residents of East Windsor and Ellington. This is your state representative, Chris Davis. Just wanted to give you a quick update here uh, from the beautiful center of Ellington on the coronavirus uh, outbreak that's taking place not only here in Connecticut, but across the country and all over the world. As you know, the state of Connecticut has a wonderful resource website, ct.gov slash coronavirus with a lot of information about uh, best practices, information about public health, information about schools, about businesses. All those are all included on ct.gov slash coronavirus. Uh, here in uh, our district, uh, we got uh, unfortunate news last night that the first confirmed case in East Windsor uh, of the coronavirus. Uh, and in Allington, so far, uh, no confirmed cases, but new data is going to be released uh, later this afternoon from the governor's office. Also, the governor has released a number of executive orders over the last few days, including ones uh, that have shut down schools in the announcement uh, just yesterday that uh, they will be closed until at least April 20th, and the governor this morning mentioned that most likely they may be closed uh, for the rest of the year. Also, the legislature is not in uh, session right now. In fact, we've extended the closure of the state capitol until at least April 13th. Um, our session is supposed to end in early May, uh, and it's unclear if we're going to be back in uh, session later this year. Uh, the situation uh, with businesses and the closure of non-essential businesses uh, effective last evening uh, has been a major point of uh, questions from constituents across the district. I would encourage you to reach out to me at christopher.davis at housegop.ct.gov uh, with any questions that you may have. Of course, this was done through an executive order from the governor's office and through guidance through his Department of Economic and Community Development. If a business truly feels like they are an essential part uh, of life-sustaining business here in Connecticut, uh, they can reach out to the Department of Economic and Community Development to request an exemption. Or as many of you have uh, reached out to me about that they didn't feel like there was enough uh, businesses being closed. Uh, you can also reach out directly to the governor's office himself or to DECD to express your concerns there as well. Uh, as always, feel free to reach out to me in my email, christopher.davis at housegop.ct. GOV, or send me a message through my website, repdavis.com. Those are the best ways to reach me right now uh, as we're all working from home uh, during this uh, coronavirus outbreak.